When it comes to fishing in Tarpon Springs, the town has a lot more in store than what its name suggests. In fact, it's situated in one of the most biodiverse regions of the Gulf, which is why today we're heading to Pinellas County, Florida to check out the hype for ourselves. We'll go over the top catches in the area, where to go, best times to head out, and everything else you need to know before you plan your trip. But before you do, be sure to like and subscribe to watch more videos about the hottest fishing spots around the globe. Since we're talking about fishing in Tarpon Springs, we'll kick the list off with none other than the city's namesake itself. Tarpon, or Silver King as they're commonly referred to, are notorious for their aggressive nature when trying to break your line. They're one of the most sought after and quite frankly, bragworthy fish in Florida. Summer is peak season for them, so be sure to plan your trip ahead of time to avoid the crowds. A close second after Silver King is Snook, and similar to their royal counterpart, they peak in the summertime as well. They usually hang out in the backcountry waters and mangroves, but can also be caught along beachfronts and shallow pilings. Just keep in mind that both tarpon and snook are subject to strict regulations throughout Florida's waters and are usually catch and release only unless you have a special permit. Another staple catch throughout the area's inshore waters is redfish. They're available throughout most of the year, but the best time to pursue them are the spring and fall seasons. Travel just a few miles off the coast and you'll experience a completely different side to fishing in Tarpon Springs. Numerous reefs along the shore provide opportunities to catch an even wider range of fish than you would close to land. The reefs here are home to delicious red snapper which you can target in the summer once their season opens. They also hold lots of grouper, triple tail, triggerfish, cobia, king mackerel, amberjack, and many others available throughout most of the year. However, if you'd rather stay inland, there are several freshwater lakes, rivers, and ponds in close proximity to Tarpon Springs that provide excellent bass fishing opportunities. Specifically, the largemouth bass bite is solid all year round, but the best months are typically late February through May. In other words, no matter when you plan your trip, there's always something biting. Next, let's take a look at some of the different areas you can hook these fish. The main fishing locations in Tarpon Springs are pretty straightforward. Head east for some incredible freshwater action thanks to Lake Tarpon and a network of smaller creeks and rivers that surround it, or head west where pristine flats meet the open waters of the Gulf and experience some of the best saltwater opportunities that Florida has to offer. We'll begin with the St. Joseph Sound, the bread and butter of the local fishing scene. Its grass flats and mangrove lined shores provide the ideal habitat for species like redfish, snook, and trout. From here, you can venture out and explore connecting waters such as the Anclote River and Gulf Intracoastal Waterway, as well as other productive bays that are dotted along the coast. If you're on the north end of the sound, rent a kayak from Fred Howard Park, or if you're heading out from the south, Pop Stanzel Park is another great launching point. If you've got a larger boat than three miles off the coast, you can fish the Anclote Key Reef a popular spot to go after various types of grouper and snapper and amberjack. In fact, Pinellas County maintains a series of artificial reefs located along the Gulf that are definitely worth checking out. Now, if you really want to experience what deep sea fishing in Tarpon Springs is all about, then we recommend hopping on a charter and checking out the middle grounds. Located some 80 miles into the Gulf, this is where you'll find even bigger versions of some of the fish we mentioned earlier, including red snapper, amberjack, grouper, and many more. Now that you know where to go, what to catch, and when to plan your trip, let's take a look at the various ways in which you can explore Tarpon Springs waters. First off, if you got your own gear and fishing license, you can take your pick from parks, causeways, and beaches and fish from solid ground. A great way to explore the flats and backcountry waters is on a kayak. You'll be able to approach less accessible spots while stealthily targeting many of the inshore species we mentioned already. You'll find the local parks and docks to be kayak friendly with several rental and guide services available as well. And of course, the most hassle-free way to go fishing in Tarpon Springs would be hopping on a fully equipped licensed charter. For group trips with family and friends, nothing beats a spacious boat where you can relax, crack open a few drinks, and fill your cooler with fish. Your captain will take care of your licenses for you, make sure the bait is fresh, and take you to the best areas to put you on fish. Same goes for any deep sea anglers looking to go after red snapper, tuna, or billfish. There are plenty of charter captains in the area who specialize in these types of excursions. Just visit fishingbooker.com or download the app to see some of the charter deals in the area and book your trip. Before you do though, it's important to familiarize yourself with some of the local rules and regulations. If you decide to go fishing on your own, whether on foot or on a boat or kayak, you'll need to get a fishing license. 
On the other hand, if you book the saltwater charter, you don't have to worry about that because the captain's license covers everyone on board. Also keep in mind that there are some species with strictly regulated seasons like red snapper that are usually only available in June. However, dates may vary year to year, so it's always a good idea to check before you set out. You also have other species such as tarpon and snook that are catch and release only. For more information on Florida fishing licenses, you could check out our full blog article or head to myfwc.com for the most up-to-date fishing regulations. And when you're ready to check out Tarpon Springs for yourself, download the Fishing Booker app or visit us online. You'll be able to browse and compare fishing charters, read customer reviews, and book your trip in just a few taps. So what are you waiting for? Head over to the App Store or go to fishingbooker.com to experience fishing in Tarpon Springs today.